Hi, good afternoon. Uh, this is our first uh, Tommy Tuesdays at 2. We're going to do a video blog every Tuesday at 2 o'clock p.m. and go over some of the highlights of the week and some of the things that are important to me. So this week was amazing. We finished our 97 town tour, you know, 75 days, 296 meetings and, and wrapped that up. It was an amazing experience. I was inspired in so many ways with, uh, with the meetings we had all across the state. Monday morning I went into the campaign office and was very much surprised. The entire team was there at 8 o'clock in the morning and had a little surprise party. We were able to reminisce and, and recap some of the, the great stops along the way. I want to give a, a, a big thank you. Um, you know, people wonder how you pull these things off, but if you look at the team we have, uh, the time and effort and personal touches they put into our tour, everywhere I went, uh, people commented on just how wonderful uh, our campaign team was to work with. So thank you very much. Uh, we did not slow down this week. Uh, the week was very fast. We had lots of meetings and a lot of things going on. A couple of highlights uh, from the week. We were able to stop by Kevin Miller's show, which is always a good time. On Wednesday, I was able to go over to Eastern Idaho. Again, go to Pocatello, uh, Idaho Falls, Rexburg, and then Twin Falls all in one day. And again, amazing meetings. Was able to do some media interviews about the tour and also was able to do a television station over in Idaho Falls. And uh, loved meeting, uh, again, a lot of the media and folks over in Eastern Idaho, which will be an important part of our campaign. Uh, back here at home, we had a couple of amazing fundraisers and meet and greets. We had one on Tuesday nights. A lot of my great business friends were there. And it was very fun for them to ask the question, what's it like being in politics for a few months? And I already had some great stories to tell them, but it's fun to see them again. Uh, one of the other great fundraisers of the week is uh, since I've announced my campaign, I've heard about the famous Grandma Luna Tacos. And Camille Blaylock, who is on our campaign team, her grandmother uh, threw a taco feed in Caldwell, Idaho on Friday uh, with, uh, with a big meet and greet. And it was very, very fun. I want to thank her because uh, what an amazing lady and, and really a um, a legend uh, in, in that area and in our state. It was National Law Enforcement Week this week and I uh, was able to have lunch with a lot of the Boise police officers that I served with. For a lot of years I worked night shifts and uh, you are in the trenches with the uh, with, uh, first responders, so EMS and the police and uh, just seeing how compassionate they are and the way that they serve and protect our community. Uh, it, was, it was fun to spend a lot of time with some of those good, good friends that I spent a lot of time with. And, and express our appreciation uh, to them. Um, healthcare is a big deal. Um, and I was able to meet uh, this week with uh, one of the CEOs of a health insurance company. Uh, good guy and very, very smart guy. We we're able to talk through some of the challenges they're having for a couple of hours. And then uh, last night, I was able to meet with uh, the Idaho Medical Association and their board. And we, we talked about the same challenges. I can tell you that in this election and in our future in the state of Idaho, health care will be one of the most important things we figure out and tackle. It's a big problem, but there are solutions, I promise you that. We're a small, nimble state with great systems and we can do some really good things. But I wanted to show you how bad the problem is. When I went around the state and talked to people, one of the things that they said almost every meeting was health care premiums, both for families and for businesses, were killing them, that we were at a tipping point. And this graph kind of illustrates that. If you see the, the dark blue is what families are contributing to healthcare since 1999 forward, and then the light blue is what companies are contributing per year uh, for healthcare premiums. And if you see what's going on here, it is not slowing down. Um, it's, it's crippling a lot of the businesses that we're, we're, we're trying to grow and families when you talk to them. Uh, those increases 242%, 213%. So something has to be done. I think there's a lot of really good ideas and I spent a lot of this week uh, preparing and planning for what that's going to look like uh, going forward. So that was fun. Uh, the other fun thing this week is people ask me all the time, how do you keep balance in your life? Um, I balance myself with my family. Um, and we were able to get up into the mountains and spend some really good time fishing and talking and, and I always love that because uh, it keeps me uh, in line and keeps me in check. Um, anyway, that was the week. It was an amazing week. Uh, uh, we look forward to doing this blog. So every single Tuesday at 2 p.m. we'll throw up a new video blog. It's also going to be where we do uh, questions and answers. So if you look right below me here, there's the links to uh, our Facebook page, to Twitter, and to just our email account. And so any way you want to get me questions, um, we will try to answer uh, those questions uh, in this weekly video blog. You're going to see us do a lot of, a lot of things. We'll kind of recap the week and, and just talk about things that are important to me. There's a lot of real traditional ways that we'll get out and meet and greet the people of Idaho in the coming year. You know, we're less than a year away from the election and that's going to be very important. But hopefully this video blog 
also is a, a format that we can talk and get to know each other and I can answer a lot of the questions that come my way. So we're excited to do this. Look forward to uh, Tuesdays and I would invite you to join us and share this with your friends, uh, with as many friends as you can so that, uh, that we can get to know each other better in the coming year and appreciate all the support I am receiving and look forward to, to meeting even more of you. Thanks a lot. We'll see you next Tuesday.